After checking out the offense last week, this week it's time to look at the 2013 Fordham defense, starting with the defensive line, which returns 2012 starter DeAndre Slate, along with seniors Brett Bistick, Eli Tenuta, and George Apostolopoulos. Slate started all 11 games and in last year for the Rams, recording 46 tackles, including 5 for a loss and 1.5 sacks. Bistick appeared in 9 games as a junior, finishing the season with 22 total tackles, 5.5 for loss and 3 sacks. He tied for 3rd on the team in tackles for loss and also broke up 6 passes. Tenuta, who moved to the defensive line from tight end last year, appeared in 10 games, making 5 starts. He recorded 23 total tackles, including 2 for a loss and 1.5 sacks and also had 2 fumble recoveries. Apostolopoulos returns after missing the 2012 season with an injury. He saw action in seven games for the Rams as a sophomore, starting one. Also returning to the defensive line in 2013 are senior Anthony Pesanello, juniors Nick Marino and Roman Herman, and sophomores David Conroy and Nick Krejci. Pesanello appeared in nine games at linebacker and on special teams as a junior, finishing the year with six total tackles. Marino played in all 11 games as a sophomore, both at linebacker and on special teams. Krejci saw action in a couple of games as a freshman, while Herman is looking for his first varsity action in 2013. The line will also be strengthened by the addition of six newcomers, including sophomore Lorenz P Piper and freshman Emmanuel Adeye, Kevin Henry, Justin Vaughn, Alex Washington, and Brandon Weir. Adeye is from Malvern High School where he earned first team all area honors as well as being named a Nassau County All-Star and Senior Bowl Defensive MVP. Henry is a product of Brother Rice High School in Bloomfield Hills, Michigan where he was a first team all league selection and first team all county pick. Piper is a graduate of Peabody Magnet High School in Alexandria, Virginia where he earned honorable mention all state accolades along with first team all district honors. Work out quarterback. Go Pipes! Yeah. Washington graduated from St. Francis de Salle High School in Columbus, Ohio, earning all Metro and all league honors in 2011. Weir, a graduate of Poughkeepsie High School in Poughkeepsie, New York, was a second team all state selection in 2011 and 2012, and a three time first team all league player. All right, Brett, uh, a little over two weeks into camp. How's it going so far? I think we're doing, doing pretty well. Uh, we're having a little back and forth between the offense as a Really good practice, and the defense has one. And then we're trying to work for we both have good practices where it's a lot of back and forth within the practice, but we're progressing each day and getting better, which is what Coach Moore wants us to be doing. Um, how do you think the defensive line's been responding so far? Uh, pretty well. We're uh, we're a lot faster than last year. We lost a lot of, of bulk, and we moved ends inside. We moved linebackers to end. So the, d the big thing for the whole defense, but in particular the defensive line, is going to be all about speed. And uh, we're, we're transitioning well to that uh, to that case. And you're, I think you're one of those people who moved, correct? When you were a linebacker originally, and then you moved to the defensive line. How how did that shift go? Uh, well, I, when I switched last year, it was uh, a little bit. It was hard at first getting down uh, into uh, the three point stance. But Coach McCarty does a great job teaching us the different pass rush moves. And when when we're on the defensive line, it's a much easier time to get after the quarterback, which is what we're trying to do on the D line. How does it uh, feel? Uh, playing for a coach like Coach McCartney, a very passionate type coach. Oh, he, uh, it's a great playing for Coach. Uh, he's tough on you, he'll never, he'll, he's never satisfied and uh, he wants you, everybody to get better. So he coaches us hard and you just gotta learn to take uh, his coaching and uh, just learn from your mistakes because he'll, he'll definitely let you know what you did. Great, thanks Brett. Thank you Mr. Brett.